people have ran into this issue where you want to be able to play Minecraft offline but still have your amazing offline skin but you're bored of this Alex or Steve skin and you don't want that. Alright, so I'm going to show you a simple solution that requires absolutely no skill whatsoever in tech at all and, a, and only a simple resource pack which I will put to, uh, the link to in the description. Alright, so I'm going to do a scene cut and I'll see you there. Alright guys, so we're on my desktop, so anyways, what we're going to do is we're going to want to use our offline skin now. So I have the resource pack here, and that has a link to it in the description that I, where you can download it for free, completely for free, with no money or payments or anything like that. Then, you're alright, so now what you're going to do is you're going to go in here, and you have here this resource pack. You're going to open up the folder your skins are in and we're going to use my uh, so and we're going to do this skin here we're going to select both and we're just going to copy and paste it in here and we're not done yet we're going to click on the assets folder then you're going to copy that here actually don't copy that don't worry about actually don't put those in there because that because uh, that will make it not work but anyways you go to minecraft you put these two who skins in here and uh, where do you see this area then you go to textures, put do the same thing, drop those skin files in there. Then you drop these skin files in the folder that we have here. And now your skins will show up as used in here. Alright, so now we have the resource pack completely done. Super easy, nothing too hard. Just a simple putting skins in the folder. Alright, so now you have our Minecraft skins and we're going to put our our skins in the resource pack folder. All right, so you, to access the resource packs, you're just gonna simply go to app percent app data. Then you're going to do percent. So that will make this here uh, show up that folder. Once you press enter, it'll take you to these things, uh, the, this stuff here. So you're gonna go to dot Minecraft resource packs and just drop that uh, custom offline skin file folder into here. And now I'm going to do a scene cut and, uh, and once I'm, I'm on my Minecraft, we will be back on. So it takes uh, quite a bit of time for it to load, so that's why I'm doing a scene cut. Alright, let's see you there. Alright, so we're here in Minecraft and I have Optify on, that's why it says modded. So anyways, you're going to go to options, you're going to click on resource packs. Now you're just going to use this skin file that you dropped in the resource packs. It should show up here. If it's so, it will say, "Hey, incompatible and stuff made for an older version of Minecraft." Don't listen to it. Just click yes. You want to use it, and then that will will put this here, and then it will work. All right. So this is just to have to reload so that it understands the resource pack. And then we are going to go into our Minecraft world and take a look at our awesome new skin that we've used. And we're offline, so it requires absolutely no Wi-Fi at all to use this awesome skin that we are going to be using. Alright, so now you have that ready. So what you're going to do is once it loads, we're just going to quickly look in here. And here we are, we've arrived in our world with my tell it's my new skin because you see that the, that the arms are nicely shaded and all nice looking but anyways if you look here there is our minecraft skin so that requires zero wi-fi and plus you don't need any wi-fi at all to use this and the resource pack is free so it's a win-win all right thanks so much for watching everyone and I hope you enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Otherwise, uh, this isn't pig right here that just ran away will have to die. Otherwise, and, but, and, but that you can save this pig's life by subscribing. Isn't that right, pig? All right, anyways, see you later, guys. Oh, just a side note, before I go, I just want to let you know to make sure that you guys have your skin file copied so that you have two of the same skin files, and make sure they're both named Steve and Alex. It's, otherwise, this won't work. Otherwise, okay, so anyways, guys, I just want to let, let you know to make sure you did that so nothing goes wrong in this process of making your skin look nice. So now I just I'm going to I'm going to close out and see you later guys. I'll see you in my next video.